Hi. Today we're going to take a look at the Momax Q Power Pro. It's a wireless battery pack with a smart dock. Um, it's for doing wireless charging for both Android and iPhones that have wireless charging capabilities. And um, we're going to just take a look, see how well it works. I've been using wireless for a little while now. I've retrofitted my Android phone with a uh, QI charging pad. It plugs into the port, and when you put this on a wireless charger, it, it provides power, and the phone just sees it as a regular charger. So that's what we're going to do here. The added benefit of this here device is that it's actually also a power bank. So this uh, you, know, you can use on the go as well as at home. So the way this works, the way I understand it, is that you charge the power bank and then you can use this anytime, anywhere to charge your phone by placing it on here. But you can then also use it at home by putting the power bank in its charging dock. Aha, like so. And then you'll be able to put your phone standing up and charge like that. So that's what we're going to test here, make sure that it all works as advertised. Uh, inside the box, uh, you get the power bank, the dock station, um, some instructions. That, you know, we don't read instructions, but they're there if we need them. And of course, uh, a charging cable. Now, this is a USB C cable to fit in both uh, the dock and at the bottom of the charging the bank. USB type C's, you're gonna to need to get either a cable, uh, well, you get a cable with it, so you'll be all right. But you won't be able to use your other chargers unless you get an adapter, which they, they do exist. Okay, so part of the problem here is they don't give you a charger. So I have to have my own charger. Which I do. So that I can then use their cable and charge. So you have to use your own. It doesn't come with one unless I'm missing it. No, not yet. So you would need to provide your own charger to provide 5 volts to this wonderful USB C device. But I have one handy, so it would be okay. So I guess the first test is we'll put it right into the power bank. The lights light up, let you know that it's charging. This one says it's half charged and it's blinking it more than that. But it should work otherwise. So here's my QI charging device. With the phone turned off, when it goes into charging mode, it turns on. So if I put it here, and turn on yet. Yeah. You see this? So, when with my personal chargers, I have to change the placement until it goes into charge mode. It's not working so far. And then there it goes. So, uh, sometimes the right placement maybe it needs to be charged up a little bit. Uh, but it is working. I have a little light that turns a different color once you've made a connection. So you'd have to rely on your phone turning on or seeing the little. Okay, well, let's try the dock. Um, so basically, this is the same thing. This just becomes uh, there's four little pins in here that fit on the bottom of your, your power bank. So it's just relaying the charge through here. So this is just a, an, just an adapter. Let you put your phone down. Uh, there's another feature of this power bank charger, wireless chargers, that you can actually also uh, charge wired in the traditional way, using the, uh, your cable and then your, your connection here. Uh, my phone happens to be the same USB-C. So uh, in using the wired 
connection, you can actually get the Qualcomm 3.0 fast charge. Uh, that's going to help you charge faster. It's quick charge, I'm sorry. Qualcomm quick charge 3.0. Uh, if your phone is ca ca uh, compatible with that, you're going to get quick charge out of this power bank. Uh, unfortunately, you can't use the cable when it's on the dock, um, but if you need quick charge, it's, it is available. Uh, if you need the slow charge, you can do this. And, and then one other added benefit of this is you can do one phone charging on the cable and then another uh, using the wireless charge. So you can actually do two phones at one time uh, if, you, if you needed to. So a, a friend needed to, to borrow your, your, your power bank, you can still charge yourself. So a uh, nice added feature to the to power bank. Uh, it does, like I said, it doesn't allow you to, to dock and do that. But uh, on the road, uh, nice feature to have, have the quick charge. You don't generally need the quick charge at home. Uh, and nice sturdy connections. Uh, it's, you'll see it's the blue, so it's a USB 3.0, which is uh, compatible with the USB Type-C. So that's a nice added feature. And uh, we've not noticed any real temperature problems with it so far. So uh, built raw, like I said, it's made of aluminum. Uh, adds a little to the weight, but actually your durability is going to be increased as well. So, seems to be a pretty solid product, and uh, I, I think I'm going to enjoy using it.